Well, we already have some damage tonight in Orange County, where a hillside gave way in San Clemente. Our live team coverage continues with KCAL 9 Orange County reporter Stacy Butler, live tonight in San Clemente with the very latest. Stacy? Yeah, Jeff, here on the side of PCH, you can see right here where this concrete wall has already come down. Take a look as the camera pans up. This is the landslide that uh, city engineers say is slow moving, but it's a real worry to a lot of the residents who live just up the hill. As another storm soaks her already soggy hillside, Gino Grady worries. There's a lot of water in the clay over here. She's afraid the landslide that has closed part of PCH just below her home in Colony Cove in San Clemente could be a sign of worse damage to come. I really didn't think that the bluff would, would be impacted, but it looks like it is. Does this worry you? Two things happening at the same time, development and then a lot of rain. And so, yeah, it's worrying. She's talking about a new development near the bluffs above the landslide, feet from her home. She says as soon as the homes went up, the rain has just kept coming. Unlike O'Grady's house, her neighbor a few doors down, you'll see the cement wall. Says years ago, the Army Corps of Engineers built a solid wall of concrete with steel under his home. If the Lord's going to take care of us, He's going to take care of us in the rain or in the sun. And so far, He's done a fantastic job. Tonight, crews are shoring up the 100 foot landslide that crept onto PCH this morning. Given the weather, we're just concerned that more may come down and we may not be able to control it. The director of public works says it's been over two decades since the landslide covered PCH just below Colony Cove. Tom Bonnegat says the steep bluffs are an untouched nature preserve. He fears a surprise large scale failure. I don't see any cracks or fissures right now, but that situation could change and that's why we're just trying to be safe. We really don't know. We've got to get through the storm period. And just to be safe, crews place these concrete K rails all the way up the stretch of PCH that's going to remain closed. And it was expected to remain closed through the end of the storm. They're not sure when that will be, but at least for a couple more days. That's the latest from San Clemente. Back to you guys in the studio.